not a big deal. Ooh, somebody just popped onto my, uh, my, my chat. Didn't post anything, but there says one viewer is waiting. In, That's always nice. In my chat, can you reset, please? Do I need to have this open? All right, hold up. We we's about to figure something out here. We may, or I may, or may not have technical difficulties in like two seconds. Uh oh. I see you connected. Yeah. Uh, I can. Okay, I'm. Starting now. Yep, I have started. Oh. Okay. Hello, everybody. PCO cast and GG. Hello, GG. Hello, PC. Let's bundle up, folks. It's going to snow. I really, I really wish snowing is... actually did something. Yeah. Oh, it's going to rain in the Fern Islands again tomorrow. That is good because I can find another one of the uh, gems. <clears throat> Uh, ooh, I've got all kinds of stuff. Oh, right, I was gonna go and uh, plant a bunch of, bunch of fertilizer and everything over there, too. Alrighty, okay, we don't have any problems. Let's go. I, uh, I wanted to see if I needed to have, um, Chrome open. Hello, Brambleberry and Anonymous Kitten. How are you doing today? Yeah, I wanted to check if I, if I needed Chrome open in order to live stream. And I don't. So. I can. I don't, I don't need Chrome so I can keep my. I think it's GP. No, wait. I don't oh. have. I have space. So you can just. You don't actually need Chrome. You can just stream directly from OBS. Yes. Ah. Okay. So you can actually just use your. Um. You basically just have a massive chat window open. Yeah, I, I have I have chat in OBS. Cool. Hello, Brambleberry. Time for some shenanigans in Stardew Valley. Yes, indeed. Um, what exactly am I doing though? That is the, that's the real question. Um, I know there was something, <laughs> some kind of plan I had. I do have wheat seeds. I mean, I guess I can just go over there, right? Over to the... To the island. Yeah. Oh, uh, in their game, uh, Molly and her friend are uh, working towards the golden uh, clock, which is 10 million gold. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> I've I've got I'm gonna have to like get rid of this mod or something. It's raining. It's raining today. Huh? Um, which which of the things do I have? I think I have the. There's a chance I could actually finish the gem puzzle. Ooh. Between, between today and tomorrow, because there's um, it's raining today and it's supposed to rain tomorrow as well. Awesome. Oh, oh, excellent. Hey, that's awesome, Kit. Kit has hit uh, one million gold in, in her Stardew playthrough. Oh, very nice. Uh, Bramble is asking if either of us are interested in Starfield. Um, I 
it depends for me i haven't seen i haven't looked up anything on starfield or about starfield okay. um normally i'm not interested in those types of games but i'm going to let it come out <laughs> um watch um some content on it and then make a decision of whether or not i'm like you know what let's do it okay yeah i've decided to uh i'm gonna do it i'm gonna play it i'm gonna i'm going to just uh sign up because i don't have um pc game pass ah uh, so you PC don't game have pass. your own game pass no don't have the pc at outcast game pass <laughs> The PC outpass. The PC outpass. <laughs> yeah, so um, so the first month uh, that you sign up for PC Game Pass, it's one dollar. So I'm oh, like, wow. so I can play Star Starfield for a month for a dollar. <laughs> wow. Like yeah. I'm like okay, if I really love it, like it's fantastic, then um, then I might buy it. Uh later like once once the dlcs and everything come out mm -hmm. might buy it then but otherwise i'll just you know i will probably play through most of the game in a month yeah especially if i do like a bunch of streaming or something uh kit kit asked isn't starfield space skyrim basically i don't know so yeah part part of it looks identical to fallout Oh really? Yeah. That's not too bad. I've been I've been playing um Fallout New Vegas for the first time. Okay, yep. And I've been having a ton of fun with that. Um I might I might do a video. I'm I'm not sure only because um I've just been having fun playing it on my own and just sort of um because like I'll call my dad because he was at like really into Fallout New Vegas when I was a kid. Okay. Yep. Um, and so like I've just been like I'll be playing the game and then I'll find something funny or interesting and then I'll call him and then we'll just talk for like three hours about New Vegas. <laughs> <sighs> cool. Yeah. It's fun. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's fun. What the hell? Ancient doll. DSPA, hello, hello. I played so much New Vegas. I have New Vegas t as well. On um, I got like, like um, the whole thing. The only thing I don't have on Epic that Epic just gave away is uh, Fallout 4. I haven't done that yet, but I got uh, Fallout 1, 2, 3, Ultimate Edition, and new vegas is it new vegas ultimate edition too i know for sure well i haven't played uh, fallout new vegas like at all and i don't think i've played all the uh dlc for fallout 3 so mm. that may happen at some point i've played um hello z let's z get back let's go um I I've played very little of Fallout 3 uh New Vegas right now that I'm playing like this is the most that I've played through um and I've played a little bit of Fallout 4 yeah, yeah. I say I say a little bit of Fallout 4 I've played a I've played a decent amount of Fallout 4 but I've not really done the main story um so it's it's kind of hard to say like have you played fallout 4 i'm like yeah but i've just sort of been going around doing my own thing like yes but no <laughs> yeah yeah <laughs> i've i've been playing fallout like i play skyrim <laughs> 
so like you, you don't finish the main quest <laughs> yeah <laughs> so it's just it, it's sort of like i i've played bits of them but i've never finished a fallout game okay yeah i like i played all the um i played all of the main quest like the main I, I pretty much played everything in fallout 4 in the base game but i never got any of the dlcs mm. i don't think don't think so so yeah if it if it comes out if uh it's like given away for free with all the dlc and stuff then i would definitely play through it again just to experience all that stuff. Uh, Fear Dan says, uh, laser detonator weapon ammo glitch is OP. Oh. Oh, brother. My, the one thing that I like about the Fallout, about Fallout 4, is that you can actually scavenge a whole bunch of, like, useless parts like miscellaneous objects and then turn them into um weapon upgrades and stuff like that yeah that's cool that's a really cool mechanic the, the whole weapon building and upgrading thing is is cool yeah it, it looks like they're carrying that over to starfield which is cool and, and it also looks like they've added way more weapons oh really yeah, like there's supposed to, I don't know, hundreds or thousands of different weapons and, and we upgrades. Like, you, you can do the same thing, you know, change the, the barrel and the stock and the clip. Is, and... it, is it really like hundreds and thousands of weapons? Or is it just, you've got like five different weapons that like have like a million different um attachments yeah we'll see yeah i mean did they are they doing like a like a borderlands kind of thing where there's literally like you know ten thousand different weapons yeah i don't, I don't know we shall see i guess we shall see I mean, I might I I don't anticipate um, I don't anticipate Starfield being like deep enough for me to like get into it like I got into Skyrim and you know do dozens or hundreds of builds and stuff. But yeah, um, but you know, I mean, I might as well play it at least play it through and. You know, enjoy it. I guess as as much as can be can be enjoyed. It's like I found Fallout Four just not not really deep enough, and I didn't I yeah. didn't I didn't enjoy the um the storylines. Yeah, thank you uh, for stopping by, Z. Uh, please stay safe and get some rest. Uh, I hope you feel better. Um, yeah, it's, I don't, the one thing that I like about, um, Fallout New Vegas, even though it can be very, um, tiring at some points when you're just trying to play through the game is how much dialogue there is. Right. Like, th like you. Oh, it, it's you, one one a.m. By the way. Oh, thank you. Yep. Like, you you ask one question and then you get like th three minutes of dialogue. Right. But they go in very in depth, and like you meet like a whole bunch of different people, even though like they're voiced by the same person, pretty much. Um. <laughs> Like one voice actor. Yeah. 
<laughs> There's like one male and one female voice actor for the entire like, game. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I'm, I'm gonna look it up, but I'm pretty sure Liam O'Brien was the one that voiced a ton of people in Fallout New Vegas. Uh, DSP says there's a glitch in Fallout New Vegas where you can put ammo from a weapon into a gun it's not for. Huh. For example, you can put nukes. Uh, nukes? Sorry, there's a... There's a uh, YouTube has added a weird thing now where you can, like... There's, like, a... Right at the bottom of chat, there's, on the right-hand side, there's, like, a thing for you to, like click a heart or a smiley or whatever and it like goes right over some of the text I'm like that is a terrible place to put that yeah uh anyway there's a glitch okay so you can put nukes in a laser detonator and have infinite nukes <laughs> oh no okay. excellent excellent oh oh my god also, if you like, uh, like, really hardcore um, survival stuff, there's, like, um, there's the, there's two, there's a mod for, I think it's for Fallout 3, and then they made, no, 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 for, uh, a mod for New Vegas, and then they just made one for Fallout 4. Um, what is it called? Not survival mode. No, I'm a mod. D okay, dust. So the dust survival simulator for for New Vegas, and what is the other one called? Frost. I think it's called Frost. I haven't checked them out. They're apparently really good. They completely changed the game, as many survival experiences it, it's not just a survival mod that adds like needs and stuff it's like a an overhaul for the whole game basically. oh wow i just i just uh counted the voices it's like 57 voices liam o'brien does oh my goodness in fallout new vegas and a ton of them are like it's just like beggar or bandit <laughs> Right. Or like, just like copy paste NPCs. Uh, you know what I'm I'm noticing as I'm playing Dragon's Dogma is a lot of the voice actors are the same from Skyrim. <laughs> really? I'm like, oh, this is this is, and I can't I can't think of like the name of the NPC that that particular voice actor is, but like a, a bunch of them are like a lot of the a lot of either the generic NPCs that you meet. Or whatever, because of course the games were made like within a year of each other, so it makes sense that those those voice actors were, you know, probably probably they worked in a, on a whole bunch of games at the same time, right? Around about that same time. Yeah. What am I doing? Food <laughs> Den says New Vegas has less voices than a Molly stream. <laughs> yeah, you. It, it's it's kind of funny. Um, cause um. you'll, um, you'll talk to someone and what'll happen is like, they'll have their own voice, but then you go like out of their dialogue and you'll walk by them. And then Liam's Liam O'Brien's voice comes out of their mouth <laughs> and you're like, huh? <laughs> okay then uh, thank goodness there's a mod to make it that uh, NPCs just don't don't just randomly ta start talking to you as you walk by yeah like you have to actually approach them can you imagine just walking into a new town and like everybody just starts randomly talking about anything like absolutely yeah. you don't get to cloud district very often do you <laughs> My my daughter died. Please don't talk to my wife. She is in mourning. I don't know you people. Yeah. Why the fuck are you talking to me?
Um, uh-oh. Uh, is Kit in your chat? Uh, I believe so. Um... Does Kit know where the Western gem bird shows up? As I'm not, I thought it was by my farm, but I'm not seeing it. Maybe I may, maybe I have to had to change screens and then go back. Lorem, welcome to the stream, a dude. So, Food Dan was uh, talking about skooma, and he said he tried it. So, what exactly is the skooma um, thing? Is it like a type of tea or what? It's liquid cocaine. It's literally cocaine. <laughs> okay, perfect. <laughs> Uh, yes, we are playing with a few mods. Um, one of mine is broken. <laughs> it should be in the corner over here. But, uh, it's not, and I don't know how to fix it. Oh, um, right, it's absinthe. Sorry. Sorry, a food Dan was just saying is it's, uh, the skooma is like 69% absinthe. Oh, wow. <laughs> uh, what mods are we using again? Uh, it's we've just got like information mods. Yeah, basically, we have the press F F one on pretty much any object, and it tells you, uh, gives you details on it. We've got the map mod that shows where NPCs are located, and we got the mod that does um, tells you like how far you have to go in experience to get to the next level in a skill. And then PC has. Cheat fishing. I also have cheat fishing. God. <laughs> okay, so Lorem has actually answered uh, that the gem bird is on the farm. Okay. Thank you, Lorem. Gotta go find it. I gotta find where. Oh, right. I need to cut down the trees myself. Also, oh, sometimes it doesn't appear. That's too bad, because, uh, you know, they only appear when it rains, and it doesn't rain that often. Uh, Kit says, I think the gem bird spawns on your farm, but I think the bird can spawn in places you've already been. Oh, okay. And I do apologize, I do not know how to pronounce your name, but thank you for coming by and talking in chat. I always mess people's names up. Yeah, I feel that. I mean, I messed up, I messed up a fish name, so... <laughs> You can also just brute force the puzzle by placing different gems on the platform. Oh, okay. That's interesting, because I only have one left. Hmm. That is very interesting. You know, it's a good thing that you're not coming over here, GG. You'd be absolutely having a fit on the way I've laid out my farm. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> like, ah, oh, PC, no! He, PC keeps the tropical farm, and I keep the one in Stardew Valley. Perfect. Ah. <laughs> and I'll, I'll come over and like, wow, this is really nice. Yeah. <laughs> you're like, oh, my God. God, what have you done? <laughs> oh, I can't wait. Oh, thanks, Laura. So, uh, taro root, if you plant along the river, it doesn't actually need to be watered. Oh, cool. 
That's actually really nice. That saves some uh, some space on the, um, the sprinklers. Okay, so I haven't actually come across the gem bird yet. It would be kind of sad if he doesn't show up this time. He, it, whatever. No idea. They. If they ha if they I don't know if they have a gender or not. It's a bird. <laughs> I I sexually identify as a bird. Yes. Okay, I'm just gonna have a quick look around and see if it respawned in any other locations. Uh, otherwise, yeah, that that's a good idea to just kind of brute force the thing. Um, Molly was telling me that um, so there's a guy na named Mr. Key. I don't think we've done anything with him yet. Um, no, I don't believe we have. But one of his one, I think it's one of the things you can buy from him is um, um, it it oh. Is there a way for me to get in here and get at that thing? No. Uh, one of the, I think one of the things you can buy from him is a a chest that's connected to another chest, so you can oh. actually have you can have one on on the farm in Stardew and one on the farm in um, Ginger Island, so we can like I'm like oh GG I need you know one of each uh, gem or whatever then oh you cool just, you can just put it into that chest and I can grab it. Bit. And vice versa. Oh my god, that's that's real nice. All right, we have a ton of wine going. Nice. We've got like over forty uh, kegs. Holy. I didn't realize we had that many. Yet. I made a ton. <laughs> and we are out of iron. No. No, wait, we've got three more. I need We need we need to uh um we need to get uh an up the upgrade, the like hundred thousand dollar upgrade to build a basement in one of our houses. <sighs> oh, you use a mod that lets you marry Pam. Huh. Thanks, Lorem. You and oh, I thought okay. the same thing at the exact same moment. Thank you. I thought I was done for. Well, I've been stuck in this cave for months. I'm going to fall asleep because I have a cutscene. <laughs> no. <laughs> One more cave mushroom salad and I would have gone off the deep end. <sighs> so rubbery. <laughs> Surviving off cave mushrooms for months. Anyway, I'm Professor Snail. I don't know if this is a good old man voice, but anyway. <laughs> I've been conducting a survey of this island's flora and fauna for the last year, although for the last few months he's been in the cave. Truly a remarkable place. <laughs> and Lorem's like, Jesus, he's been eating shrooms for months. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think I'll go back to my uh, tent and freshen up a little. I'm afraid I smell like mushrooms. Hey, you should stop by the tent sometime. An enterprising individual like yourself could be a major asset in my project. <laughs> um, uh, farewell. <laughs> quite, I'm quite all right by not going to your tent. Oh, and I just fell asleep. Nice. Well, sorry, I think I just cost us a thousand gold again. Yeah, it's whatever. Ah, money. The way PC said thank you reminds me of Beetle from Legend, Legend of Zelda. 
Pam or Penny? Um, let me... Okay, Food Dan says he thinks that Absinthe is pretty much the closest thing to in real life skooma. The old recipe for it made people hallucinate. That's why the US banned it. <laughs> Even though it's fine now and just similar to tequila. Hmm. Yeah, there was I remember hearing about that. I never I never I have never tried it. Oh, there is too much stuff in my inventory. Question, can you put wine back into a keg? Uh, no. No? Then how do we... So. Huh. I guess you get the, the higher leveled um wines by using high level fruits uh no you have to build the um the uh oh, where's the stuff uh you have to build the um cellar upgrade for your house and then uh, you can plant that. I mean, you can you put the wine in. There's like a different type. It's like a barrel, so it's not a keg. It's a slight, It's a little bit different than the uh, uh, than the kegs. And then you put it in there, and, the, and it ages. Oh, so that's what Kit was doing. Okay. Uh, no, we have not gotten perfection yet, but I don't think we're going to get perfection. Because. Hmm, thanks for the or... tip, uh, Lorem. By the way, how far out can you plant these? Like, is it just just the first tile right next to the river that you can plant it and it stays wet? Hello, Game Dan. Thank you for stopping by. Do, do, do. Five tiles in? Holy crap. Wow. Oh, that's awesome. That's really awesome. I accept. I accept. And it's also rain. I just suddenly realized it's raining again today. So there is a chance of another bird. Hey. Come on, bird. I only need one more thing. It's a bit sad that Pierre has a monopoly on vinegar. Uh, He's cornered the market, folks. He's almost as bad as Jojo Mart. Yeah. I'm not on uh, Ginger Island, but PC is. That is my current stomping ground. Yes. Um, wow, there's actually a long section of river where you can put stuff. That's pretty cool. Ginger Island's really nice. It's like it's a great place for a for a um, farm because it's you get like a whole bunch of perks that that don't happen back on Stardew. Ah, uh. you get a perk. You know, you get the perk that it's it's always the same temperature, so you can grow whatever you want any any time of year. Mm. Um. Some things don't need to be watered. It's pretty nice. Fun <sighs> fact, crows don't spawn on Ginger Island. And 
Apparently Penny sucks. I wouldn't be surprised. Okay, I still didn't find the gem bird. That stinks. Maybe I should head back and go grab. Okay, so let's see. I have, I think, a topaz, an emerald, and something. Hmm. Oh, um, Molly also gave me a tip on um, uh, finding finding um, the uh, walnuts. If you go and speak to every day, you can go and speak to the parrot in Leo's hut, and it'll give you a hint so mm. where there's where there's walnuts. So if they're always like, if they like never mention like the water, or like for example the water, then you, that means you've you've already fished out all the walnuts that you can get from the water. Oh, okay. Like, oh, okay, cool, cool. That's that's good. All right, so I have a topaz, a ruby, and an emerald. So, does anybody happen to know what what other um, uh, gems? Like, is there? It can it be any gem, or because I I don't want to want to make sure I bring back all the gems that I could possibly need for that last pedestal. I'm going to look it up, but just in case anybody knows. Uh, the... Actually, I don't... Why do you need the gym again? Uh, just haven't... to finish this, finish this puzzle. Ah, on Gingerland. Right, okay. Uh... Uh, do do do. And it's kind of cool because gem birds keep showing up. I know that happened. Um. Oh, okay. Lorem says aquamarine, diamond, and amethyst. Is that it? Like I only need those three. It has to be one of those three. I better head back. Before it gets too late. I also found a hip bone or something that I can give to uh, Gunther. Nice. Oh, oh, there it is. Never mind. No, that's another emerald. Uh, okay, I don't need another emerald. Doo -doo. All right. Uh, Kit says aquamarine, topaz, amethyst, emerald, or ruby. Yeah, because I already did. The, I already have topaz, ro ruby, and emerald on there. I think they're in the right order. <laughs> We've got an iridium rabbit's foot, a gold rabbit's foot, and a silver rabbit's foot. Oh, nice. These are the gems they can spawn as. Um, I should pet the, the cow and the horse. Fair enough. The I just like harvested five winter roots out of the out of the beach. Nice. Um, Oh, uh, I, we got Sturgeon Row. Yeah. Uh, what did we need that for again? <laughs> uh, I don't know. I think you needed it for sushi. 
Oh no, it's for um, uh, it's for caviar. Oh, for the abandoned Joja Mart bundle. Ah, uh, uh, yes, I believe. How do you make caviar again? I don't know. No, I don't want to eat the sturgeon roe. I'm going to put your sturgeon roe in your fridge. Okay. Um. Okay. It just needs to be put in a preserves jar. Oh, cool. Fun fact. An iridium rabbit's foot given to a villager on their birthday, besides Penny, can give you a lot of friendship hearts. Interesting. In fact, if you type debug in the game chat, there's an Easter egg. Oh, interesting. I mm. might try that later. Oh, hello, PC. Hello. Let me... Uh, void salmon, which is another thing we need, can be caught outside the witch's hut. Secret entrance is at the train station. Okay. Oh, wow. We only have uh, three emeralds. Okay, so we've got aquamarine. Oh, my God. Um... Oh, don't tell me. Amethyst? Oh. And diamond. Okay. I hope that's all they can be, because that's all I've got. <laughs> so that's going to be pretty cool, getting that all done. Uh, uh. Hello. Hello. So the stir the row has to be put into preserve star. I'll, I'll I'll go do that. Diamond isn't one that can spawn with a gem bird. Diamond is not one that can be spawned. So can it only be aquamarine and amethyst left then? Or is there something else? All right, hold up. All right, hold up. I'm going to look that up just to be safe. Yeah, I don't want to go back, like go over there and then be like, oh, I needed <laughs> this other thing. Uh, excuse me for just a second. I'm gonna get used to wash them. Oh, good. Oh, I should. I need to get in bed. So do I. <laughs> <laughs> Don't uh, run to the washroom while it's nighttime. <laughs> just about. Oh man, making money. Yep, I wanted to, I wanted to check that. Oh wow, melon jelly. Uh, wow.
Oh. Cool. <laughs> Oops. Well. I guess that works. Uh, let me I think it's this one. Yep. Oh, hello. I'm in a cutscene. Oh, well, the connection failed. Ow. I'm sorry. I hope it. I hope you can get reconnected. Uh, Grandpa says it's been many years since we last spoke. You were just a little boy. Do you remember? Look how far you've come. Though you have oh. forgotten me, you may have forgotten me. I've been here all, all along. You see, my body has departed this world, but my heart will always remain in Stardew Valley. It's Grandpa. You've been here for two years now. You've done well, my boy. Commune Farm has never looked better. It's an honor to the family name. <laughs> Grandpa is pleased. Uh, okay. <laughs> Future of Commune Farm is in your hands now. Farewell. Oh boy, connection failed. No! What is happening? Oh, we get the Iridium statue? Let's go. Oh. The candles are just lit up on my uh, grandpa's. Oh my goodness, what a mess. Uh. What is the spring, summer? What, what is going on? How do, you, how do you know what uh, season it is? I mean, it has it up here, but I don't know what that means. It's got like a sun. The farm's a mess. Oops. Um, are you back yet, Gigi? Uh, not yet. I am in now. Cool. Uh, did we get a final answer on the potential gems? Um, yeah. It, um... Aquamarine, Topaz, Amethyst, Emerald, or Ruby are the gems that can spawn. Okay. Sounds like uh, the last one can only be uh, Amethyst or Aquamarine, then. I hope. <laughs> okay. Thank you for stopping by, Game Dan. I hope work goes well. And another cutscene. Ah, another beautiful day in Pelican Town. Parrots are flying through town. Hey. My friends! Um... Oh! One of them just flew into our window. No. Oh no, you poor thing. Your wing's broken. Bro. Oh, you're a bit different than the others, aren't you? Just like me. Don't worry, I'll nurse you back to health, little one. Everything will be all right. 
Emily is uh, oh. nursing a parrot. Oh. Emily took the injured parrot into her home and bandaged the wing. He's all set up in a room, but ha but as a token of respect, she didn't give the bird a name. <laughs> okay. Uh. Added. Diplomatic community. That's what it sounds like. <laughs> uh, okay. Mm. Bug gut. A bug gut quest. You know, the other thing I should have done is brought all, all of the um, geodes and stuff with me. Could have got uh, Clint to break them all up. Hmm. I, I got a I got a note. Uh, I wasn't sure what it was for. Um, give me one sec. There we go. Ooh, five, five golden walnuts for completing that quest. Nice. Excellent. Excellent. Uh, that's just, ah, that's, ah, one nutty stone in Fire Mountain. Okay. Nice. Uh, A nutty stone. All right. Hopefully. Oh, oh, that's weird to see. All right, I will try that command in just a little bit. I have a one-track mind, sadly. <laughs> and we've got ancient fruit. Hey. Again, once again, what is the re recipe for um for a seed maker? And how do we get it? Farming level nine. You're not at level nine yet, are you? Uh, no, I am at level eight. Okay, I'm at level six, so that's going to be a while.
All right. It was flash. Ooh, I got a whole bunch Let's of stuff try. that's gonna, gonna ripen tomorrow. And then nice. what was the other one? It was flash. Oh boy. Oh, by the way, we have a. I guess I have a quest to bring a uh, battery pack to Pam. Hmm. Um. So I have five walnuts. Should I? Hmm. Um. Should I save them? I can. I think I can unlock the mailbox on the island, or I can save the walnuts. I mean, is what is important here? Yeah, that's the question. Keep walnuts for resort, says Lorem. Okay. I think I need these right for the okay. guy. Not sure which of these I need. I think it's this one. Maybe that. Mummified and fossilized. That's fossilized as well. Oh, these are actually not not listed as artifacts. Interesting. I think those are all for the for the archaeologists. Am I spelling it wrong? Did I stutter? <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Nothing is coming up. Oh, of course. I went in here for a cutscene at the end of the day again. Ah, come in! Come Smart. in! Smart. <laughs> Welcome to my field office! As you can see, it's quite empty. Uh, getting stuck in that cave was a huge setback to my project. But that's where you come in! Hehe. <laughs> Huh? <laughs> it's getting late, by the way. Yep. <laughs> I'm in the bone business, you see. Ancient bones in particular, and this island's full of them. So if you ever encounter any bones, fossils, or mummified specimens on this island, bring them to my desk, okay? I'll make, make it worth your while. And I'm gonna... Oh, wait, no, it's, it's okay, maybe? Okay. Cool. To think generations have come and gone while this little bone lay hidden beneath the soil. Now it's mine. <sighs> yeah, my character's yawning too. No. Can I make it back? Can you? Oh, yeah, no problem. That's fine. Hey, nice. No passing out today. Alrighty. I can give you the answers to the quizzes if you don't want to look for the things, says Kit. We got mail. Here, Zach. Here's a vegetable from the little garden they keep out back. 
<sighs> you probably have more veggies than you know what to do with, but oh well, Caroline. So we don't actually... I guess I lost that quest to do the terror right thing. Hmm. That's too bad. Oh yeah, so you don't get any wheat seeds when you harvest when you harvest hay. That's too bad. Hmm. Pretty. Well, that's a shame. I guess I'll just wait and get a bunch of uh, wheat seeds at some point. I also don't get any taro roots from the for like to plant when you get when you harvest the taro roots. That is a massive sadness. from the volcano. Okay. Yeah, I guess I might as well go. Oh, there, I did get one uh, tarot tuber. Yeah, I'm here. Would you expect? That's funny. You know what I should have done? Because mm. I, I don't think you're, you've been using the... Uh, I don't think you've been using the... Yeah, seed maker uh, recently, right? So I should have I just uh, picked it up when I was last there. Mm. Oh, well. No. in there that's good let's go to the the uh, volcano and see what I can see I it takes me a long time to get through that place though I take all day and I don't get to the end uh.
Can you imagine, like, bypass these things? Yeah, just don't fight anything you don't have to. Uh, by the way, do you still need iron? Uh... Yeah, I, I will. Yeah, because I can get, like, tons of it in the, in the, uh... Volcano. I'm gonna get arthritis. That's not the direction I wanted that to go. Get it to bounce multiple times. It oh not over a torch. Oh my god. Okay. Well, that was a good one. Ah, I can't get out there. That's not what I wanted to do. Oops. I accidentally um knocked the preserved jar. Um, uh -oh. Does that was... mean that we don't have any yet? Yeah. We I, lost, I... lost the caviar. <laughs> yeah, we lost. Oh, fuck. I put the preserve jar in the greenhouse. Oh, hey, I see. That's well. I, I I hit it, and I was moving stuff, but I didn't mean to hit the preserve jar. I just misclicked. But I'm trying to like move stuff around. Got it. Oh no. Well, uh, yeah, if the, if the row came out of there, then I guess we're gonna have to wait until there's more, until we find more, uh, row. Oops. I'll be key. So, I mean, until they produce more row. Yeah. Oh, well. oh my god, there's so much fruit in here. In the, You in... thought you had put all the fruit into kegs. <laughs> I, I mean, there, there's so much fruit in the uh, bat cave. Yeah. Ooh, okay. I just got another uh, walnut from breaking a rock. Nice. This is good. And Lorem war warned me that the uh, penalty for passing out in the volcano is 2,000 gold. Uh, uh, is it just 2,000? Do you lose anything? So if you don't lose anything... Fish in the fountain near the community... Sorry. Terrible. Uh, fish in the fountain near the community center a few times for decoration. Ooh, okay. I will do that. In a little, I want to... Uh, 
Ah, uh, that's the fast way out, I think. Oh yeah, I'd still like to get those cinder shoes. That would be very nice. So I need a hundred cinder shards for that. Those shoes are pretty nice. Okay. Ooh, getting shot at. That's always fun. Where'd he go? He's way over there? Nah, that's that's just rude. Um Okay. Um oh, move, 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 move. There we go. Okay, come over here. Yep. Perfect. Oh, I am almost dead. Oh, no, 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 no. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, God damn it, you bastard. He flew right through me. Ah. Oh, mm, I think I'm going to lose stuff if you die there. Are you OK? I find you washed up on shore. Really had me worried. I thought you were a goner. Be a little more careful out there. The island can be dangerous. Yeah, what happened to me? Seems you lost 5,000 gold and four items from my backpack. Ugh. Oh. I lost 5,000 gold and 2,335 gold worth of stuff in my back from my backpack. Ah. Uh, uh. Nice. Oh, man. Well, you know, sometimes things just suck. Uh, I'm uh, really sorry for that, JJ. Uh, you're, you're fine. I'm not uh, worried. Don't die in there. I'm not oh. worried about the money. Because we're going to be able to get all of that stuff back. So it's kind of like. Eh. Eh. It's more, it's more of like if you lose an item that we really need, then it's kind of like. Crap. Yeah. But it's like it's money. Money can we can just make money back. Yeah. <laughs> but not, if it's, it's all... not as bad as, as something that's like a rare drop or something. Yeah. And, right. that, and then that's just more annoying than anything. Nothing to get angry over, because he's a game. He's a game. He should be enjoying it, having yes, fun. Yes, exactly. <laughs> uh, Lorem just asked if I have the slime ring. Um, no, I don't believe either of us do. I don't think so. Where do we where do we get that? I can't make it, right? We have to kill a hundred slimes. Oh. Uh, I can make the thorn ring, the warrior ring, a sturdy ring, the ring of Yoba, and a glowstone ring. The ring of Yoda. Mm. Mm. Occasionally shields the wearer from damage. Occasionally. <laughs> yes. Um, a sturdy ring cuts duration of negative stat effect, status effects in half. That's nice. Oh, cool. Um, uh, the warrior ring occasionally infuses a wearer with warrior energy after slaying a monster. Yeah. Oh, and the thorn rings is that when enemies damage you, they also take damage themselves. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, Lorem's just saying, like, if I have the slime ring, then uh, slime charmer ring, then the tiger, it'll help with the tiger, tiger slimes that are getting me in the, in the, um, 
uh, in the volcano. Hmm. Okay. Uh... So, Slime Charmer Ring can be obtained as a reward from Gil at the Adventurer's Guild after completing the monster eradication goal of killing 1,000 slimes. After that, it can be purchased from, from Marlin for 25,000 gold. Oh, you get the Slime Ring when you kill 1,000 slimes from the Adventurer's Guild. Yeah. Not 100. I'm it stupid. prevents damage from slimes. Man, that's nice. Does it, yeah. does it also prevent the, the like goo thing that makes you walk, go really slow? I would hope so. Yeah, I'd hope so too. Sad. Oh, good news is I managed to get 35 iron ore. Hey, so, that. All right, let me stick this in the Geo Crusher. Okay, it prevents the slime to debuff too. Man, that's nice. Yeah. That, that uh, reduces the potential danger of the um, the um, thing <laughs> quite a bit. The uh, volcano. All right, and tomorrow, tomorrow my melons are all gonna ripen so I can go talk to the frog and make him happy about that. All right, I think, uh, unfortunately I lost a lot of money. that yeah I basically need oh I need I need all the stuff for, I might as well go back to town and take um so you take this and this Got a protection ringer. Ring, protection ringer. ringer. Yep. Stay invincible for a little while after taking damage. Oh, I still only have 68 cinder shards, so I can't buy that thing anyway. Take these. Oh, I heard it. These. Not paying attention. These. I think that's good. Oh, yeah. Hey, Leo, how's it going, man? Sorry, I'm shy today. Okay. <sighs> you, you be shy over there, bud. Me. I'm just shy. Yep, yep. I'm feeling shy today. Oh, okay. So I can buy. I can use um bone fragments to buy tarot tubers from uh, the the uh, outpost trading thing here. That's cool. What oh, does he not buy? Oh, he does not buy uh the. Oh, I can use tarot tubers to buy warp totems back to the farm. Ooh, that's nice. Although, I mean, going back to the farm is free. The problem is um, getting back to the. Yeah, 
I, I need a uh, an island totem, not a not a farm totem. Don't close, please. Ah, it's gonna be closed by the time I get over there. Dude, stay open. All right, I gotta. I'm gonna grab a whole bunch of seeds. Okay. And start farming. Oh, nice. Okay, process things. That. Oh, that's literally my entire inventory. Okay, well, I guess I'm throwing the stuff away. Ah, <gasps> what is that? It's a... ah, it's a mango tree. And don't need that. Already have it. You know what? Get rid of this too. Dude, are you... Ow. Fine. Well, I got a mango tree sapling. Kinda cool. Do, 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 do. <laughs> I'm like, hey, Harvey, how's it going? It's been ages. Cover your mouth when you sneeze. No. Uh, okay. <laughs> Man, this last level of foraging is such an unbelievable grind to get enough experience. Yeah. Uh, uh, what is it? Craft. I need. I need fiber and coal. Hey, man! Nice tank top. Or yeah. Yeah. Tank top. Yeah. Uh. Um, do, do you want me to plant this mango sapling here? Like in the, in the, yeah, greenhouse? Is there room for it? Sure. Is this, is this okay? That's two away from the next one, yeah? Hmm. I hope that's acceptable. Clint can still open geodes even if he's not at the counter, but he I couldn't interact with him. Did I have to click on the counter? That would be unfortunate. <laughs> oh, where's Haley? Where's my girl? Can I go visit her still? Haley, I'm coming. I've got a coconut for you. Uh. Ah, 
Thanks, Laura. Okay, so I could have clicked on the, uh, just clicked on the counter and he still would have opened geodes for me. Well, that's too bad. Nah, can't go in. The girls are like, it's after 8 p.m. We do not accept calls from suitors. Nah. <laughs> my horse went right to wow. the table. <laughs> nice. You've got a magical horse. Ah. <laughs> <Like>, uh... <laughs> what did you just pick up? What was that? What? What did you have in your hand? Uh, oh. my watering can. I just refilled no, it. That red thing. Oh, this? No. That? Yeah. It's a mushroom. Oh. Magma cap mushroom. It gives 315 energy and 141 health. Huh. Yeah, that's pretty nice. I think I'm actually going to sell that one. Because I think they're worth quite a bit. Oh, 600 gold. Damn. How much is the silver one worth? 500 gold. Hello, Zach's horse. How are you doing? Oh, sorry. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Didn't mean to uh, start riding uh, your horse. Wait until you get iridium quality magna magma caps. Can you do anything with them? Oh, you can make a shirt. Make a magenta shirt out of them. Oh, look at this. It's not where I wanted that. <sighs> well. My, oh, or not my OCD brain, but my. <laughs> um. Your sense of aesthetics. How, um. Uh Wait. You're about to pass oh, out. Cool. Or am I? <laughs> Just proceeded to stand outside. I have the ability to teleport to bed. Mm. Ooh. Hey, I actually contributed a bit by uh, by uh, selling a bunch of forged stuff. Let's yeah. go. <laughs> Alrighty. Um. Oh, thirty hay from Marnie. Thanks, Marnie. Appreciate it. Oh, I've got extra hay. Lots and lots of extra hay. Are they worth anything? No. Um. Um. I've put. I'm gonna put some extra hay into one of the chests in here. Alright. Oh yeah, there's already extra hay there. Awesome. Perfect. Ooh. Oh, I somehow ended up with one of these. Cool. Thank you. Yeah.
Not sure where I got that from. I probably messed something up in your uh, design. Nah. I did that and nothing happened. Oh, we got more salmon row. Or not sturgeon. We sturgeon row. Awesome. Getting like so many rare uh, um, things out of these geodes, but I think I we've already found all of them. <laughs> oh no, there's one. There's a new one for Gunther. Nice. And another one. And another one. <sighs> Don't have enough inventory. stuff for the museum is always nice. Hello, Bob Gang. I hope you are doing well. Thank you for coming by and saying hi in chat. Um, I do not, um... I play with a, another YouTuber, uh, but we have thought of playing with viewers. Dar Shards. No one knows where these came from. Some scientists claim that the microscopic structure displays unnatural regularity. No, okay. I do not want to eat the sturgeon row. <laughs> We're going to put <laughs> no. it in the preserves <laughs> jar. <laughs> you know what? I'm just going to sell these for now. That's pain. Oh, and let's, let me get my horse that I spent a bunch of money on. Um, where is Haley? Like, I've decided I'm going to organize my clothes today. I'll have to throw out all of last year's styles to make room for the new ones. Uh. Great. <laughs> have fun. Oh my goodness. I am so far, I'm so far from getting anywhere with her. Good grief. Uh. I got two hearts. <laughs> nice. Uh, 
I'm not even going to get to the mines at all. I'm going to spend my entire day just trying to break apart a bunch of geodes. <laughs> Flint can buy minerals. You mean like all the stuff that I don't need? Oh, so I don't have to carry it back. That's that's a good idea. Shop. Um. I think these are fine. That's actually a really nice feature. And I, I, I don't think I ever sell anything, have ever sold anything to uh, directly to an NPC in here in this game. <laughs> uh... A new reward. Burnt offering. Okay, it's a, a weird triangle thing. Uh, let's go talk to the Adventurers Guild. I want to see how far we are on the uh, slime thing. Do we have to each? Kill kill a thousand slimes, or just one of us to complete this? I think it's each of us. Or well, oh, I'm feeling exhausted. Let me drink a coffee. Well, I'm at we're at four hundred. I'm at, or we oh. are at four hundred and sixty-five out of a thousand slimes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, uh, what are good um, slime levels? A green slime appears in levels 1 through 9, as well as 11 through 19, 20 to 29. Okay. Uh, also, bugs are on level 1 through 9, 11 to 19, 21 to 29, because I need to do both of those things, so. You know what? I might as well just spend a few minutes in the mines, eh? Oops. I need to actually have my chat open. Uh, not have a not have a page to uh the wiki. <laughs> uh.
All right. Well, that's some stuff done. Killed exactly one out of a hundred bugs. Oh. I can't. Where do I? Oh, it has to be placed on the wall. Got it. Okay. Already. Um, I'm just gonna use the washroom again. Right All back. good. And now we wait for PC. I hope everyone is having a a nice, relaxing time. I apologize I haven't been talking much. I've been getting very uh hyper focused and just like Trying to like really put out some uh progress. Hold up one sec. I'm in the middle of a thunderstorm. Like, what was that noise? <clears throat> oh, sorry about that. Oh, I reached level nine in uh, mining. Nice. I can actually make a crystallarium now. Ooh, what's that? That's a recipe for that. That's the thing that uh, turns gems into. Oh. Uh, like, like makes new gems. Oh, okay. Yeah, it, like yeah. Into it. yeah. It synthesizes. That would actually be. I wonder where you can place those, because that could be a massive amount of money. Yeah. Um. Oh, interesting. Apparently, play, placing crystallariums is a popular uh, 
it in the quarry is popular. Holy crap, that's a lot of crystallariums. Okay, because the quarry is obviously not... Hey, Molly. They got, like, crystallariums absolutely packed all over the quarry and producing diamonds. Time to get rich, says Lorem. Hello, Bob gang. Thanks for stopping by my chat as well. The... Bob Crystal Bob is in your chat there. Right? Yeah. The crystallarium is um it takes uh two iridium bars and you can place them anywhere, but they get destroyed if a villager walks through them. Okay, so you want to have it somewhere where uh villagers don't go. That's probably why the quarry is a popular place to put it. Yeah. Oof, but two iridium bars, damn. That's uh that's not cheap. Not a cheap way to make money. <laughs> yeah. Kinda cool though. Uh... I've definitely never made like a ton of crystal irons. It just it just seems like a slow way to make money. Mm hmm Um, okay. Back into the mines, I guess. I gotta head back to the Thing. We don't have a ton of time left in the stream, but yeah. I should head back to the, uh... I made you a little treat oh. this morning in the saloon. Dig in. Your friend Gus. Pancakes. Let's go. Oh yeah, pan I could go for some pancakes right now. Hello, the 29th emu. What happened to 1 through 28? What am I doing? My brain. Work for me, please. I'm sorry for your the loss of your brothers. I could use my horse. space oh no no have you got the full upgrade on your um backpack yet yes <sighs> i need to do that too uh... okay dear lord oh Good, good to know. Um, okay. It's not where I put that. Kill all the bugs. Okay. My inventory has been 
smoothed out some. Nice. I really don't need... I can just put the milk pan. Well, thank you for stopping by. Point I demo. It means a lot. I this is my first playthrough of the game as well. Uh, not what I want. I am making some very slow progress in the uh, area of bug collecting, bug gut collecting specifically. Nice. Yeah. Uh, I'm killing a ton of slimes though, so... Making some progress on that quest. Nice. Let's see here. Um... Oh wow, there's like nothing on this this level at all. That's not what I wanted to do. <laughs> I can only count to four. <laughs> Thank you for stopping by, Anonymous Kit. I hope you have a wonderful day. Stay safe. Thanks. Oh. Oh, yeah. Got an attack of the bugs. I used to really hate the flies, but when you can one-shot them... Wow. Oh. And they do hardly any damage there. There we go. And then... Oh no. We'd feel more at home with a jelly. The fish are speaking to me once again. Oh no. Oh no. You see, I don't think I took my psych meds today. <laughs> Um, something wrong. Something's wrong, PC. The, the, the fish are speaking to me. Uh, the walls. They're talking. There's people in the walls. Oh, oh God! I, me making that joke. Okay, fifty wood, forty stone, eight coal. Okay. Not exactly what I meant to do, but that works. Wood. Done. Um, all I need is a jelly. Oh, bugs. Bugs and slimes galore. Nice. 
Oh, the wine. Uh... Oh, and a, a level down. Oh, and this area's been infested. Awesome. <laughs> you know, I used to hate these, and I'm like, yeah. Nah. <laughs> bring, on, bring on all the slimes. <laughs> I'm I'm very curious to see how much gold I'm about to make. I just found another ancient seed. That's I found three ancient seeds in this game. That's like ridiculous. Hmm. Usually I struggle to find one. Kind of got attacked. Oh, yeah. Uh oh, getting late. Oof. Um, uh, you know what, instead of going deeper, I'm just going to leave. Aw, my horse is in here. That's sad. Okay, that went quite well. Yes, one... Hey, can you make a scarecrow for me? Um, yes, wood, coal, fiber. Uh, oh, there's only a little bit of uh, fiber. Shit, I forgot about that. Oh, wait, I think we have a ton of scarecrows anyway. Uh, the special scarecrows, uh, yeah. there, there's like five of them in this chest okay uh place one down over here and then go to bed or just go to bed just go to bed like here just go to bed Good. just go to bed oh god i'm gonna i'm not gonna make it i'm not gonna make it no. I'm <laughs> <down>. <laughs> no. uh, i made it into my doorway i mean that's, that's something good Ooh, combat uh, combat level nine, I can make squid ink ravioli and an iridium band. Oh. Whatever that is. Holy crap, 7,000 gold from mayonnaise? And wine. Oh, and blackberry wine. Not red, but it's wine. That's wine. I mean, blackberry wine would probably be pretty good. Oh, yeah. All right, I guess we should stop there. I think that's the two hour mark. Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll stop there. Kind of. Oh my gosh. Kind of in a groove right now. This farm is, uh, go outside real quick, PC. Look at that. 
it's weirdly it's weirdly put together because i was like running some ideas in my head but once once fall comes around then i can like reorganize everything we're gonna have to move this uh oh we also um you, you should also be planting um uh sprinklers yeah, i need iridium i want i want iridium powered sprinklers Oh yeah, with the jet attachment so that like covers like half the half the map. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh. Ooh, and it's an oak tree. Okay, cool. Well, yeah. we did. We got a ton of stuff done. I don't know if I'm gonna get this bug quest done. Got two more days. Actually, I have two more days, and I've killed forty-eight of them. So nice. Yeah. All right. Well, thank you, everybody, for joining us once again. It was a lot of fun. Yes, thank you. Thank you for all the new people that just, like, stopped by. That was awesome. Yeah, YouTube, thank you. YouTube is like, I am going to promote GG with the Stardew Valley thing. Have Finally. You, have, you, have you watched Stardew Valley? Have you, play, <laughs> have you watched GG play Stardew Valley? Wow. Come and check him out. <laughs> <laughs> Getting new people is fun. New people is always fun. <clears throat> All right. Um, what do you got coming up on your channel? Um, I'm going to be recording some Minecraft stuff, uh, which I am completely new to the recording on my own not doing a live stream so it's just me and a camera which is really weird for me i don't know why my brain just like gets in itself about it but mm -hmm. um i plan on doing some octopath traveler um throughout the week um and other than that that's about it for right now um I might start doing uh, some Fallout or Skyrim streams. Oh, uh, cool! That would be that would be fun. I wanna. I need to start getting on the things that like I'm really wanting to push for at some point. So yeah, I think I think things are finally starting to. Uh, my life is starting to slow down, so I can really focus on this nice yeah that's cool it's exciting yeah for sure uh for me uh i just finished the portal series i saw that i need, yes, to, I need to watch I, it yeah um I, I i managed to get through um portal one and two and then i was doing the reloaded mod and I cannot get it's got like a fourth dimension and I can't get my brain around it. Ooh, so, that's exciting. I kind of I kind of um stumbled and fell my way through like a few a few levels and I'm like no, this is just my brain does not do this. So Oh, man. <laughs> I, I I had to quit. Unfortunately, but um tomorrow starts my um uh, uh, Rain Valley 2 series, which is basically a Ooh. rain based puzzles game, yeah. which I am thoroughly enjoying. And I'm like recorded way out. I have to actually get back and start recording more Dragon's Dogma. <laughs> 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 nice. Anyway, yeah, I kind of fell into a rabbit hole there. I thought, I, I thought, oh, well, I'll check it out and see what it, it looks kind of nice and stuff. And I'm like, oh my god, more, more, play more. <laughs> <laughs> so that's what I'm doing right now. And otherwise, I guess we'll be back next week with another Stardew. Awesome. Yeah. All right. Thanks for joining us, guys. We'll see you next time. See ya.